Hello and welcome to another episode of Crazy About Fly Fishing. Today I've been fishing with John from Adrift Fishing. He's back there trying to catch another trout. And uh, we had a good session in the bridge pool today. So yeah, hope you enjoy and uh, see what we get. Yeah, making a start of the famous bridge pool. We'll see how we go here. Just had lunch. I visited Brian Wilson in the new fishing and guiding Turangi Limited. Here we go. Fish on! Gotta love the bridge pool. Oh, nice jumper. Nice to fish with a reel with a bit of drag again. This is the uh, DL reel from I Love Fly Fishing. Let's fish up a bit. Yes, got him. Nice. Well, first fish for the session. A little bit of a slab, but uh, yeah, nice to get the first fish on the board. Maybe about two and a half pounds. If it was good condition, it would probably be three. Nice. I'm in front of Fishing and Guiding Turangi Limited. New shop in Turangi, owned by uh, fishing guide Brian Wilson that have fished with me before. So let me take you inside. We open on October the 1st. Uh, we offer a comprehensive guiding service for anyone that wants to get out there and try and catch a trout. Either experienced or inexperienced, we're getting a number of clients here as well with uh, people missing from overseas. So uh, it's good and we're selling a bit of uh, good gear from I Love Fly Fishing. So it's working very well. I've been thinking about it for a while but uh, COVID-19 sort of accelerated my thought process on this one. Um, as we've lost a lot of our customers from overseas, I thought I'd uh, operate a base from here in Turingi. And uh, so it just made me bring the, my ideas of having a shop a bit earlier. But it's something I've been toying with for a while. And, uh, and so here we are. That's how, it's, how, how, we, how we're here today. Yeah. Well, nice to be on the board pretty quick. Um, I'm fishing a double nymph rig with a pink tungsten beaded caddis fly as the heavy fly and a size 14 flashback pheasant tail on the point. I've just got the indicator. I've got quite a long leader. I've got a nine foot tapered leader and then I've got about three feet off the end of that of 3x and that goes to my first heavy fly and then another two feet of 3x to my to my point fly might potentially go for something a bit heavier there we go oh, there we go Feels like a good fish. Might be a fresh one. Oh, let's let it sit there for a while. Be a bit patient for a change. I don't want to stay up here, but. Looks like it might have someone's fly stuck in it still. Oh no, it's got a gash in it. There we go. Got a big gash in it. 
and took the pheasant tail. Yeah, you got a big gash in it there. Oh, well, there we go, released. <laughs> well, that fish took the pheasant tail. So uh, there seems to be a few here, a couple already. John's not having a great deal of luck that side though. Hopefully we'll get one soon. We saw quite a few fish on that side from the uh, bridge, but it's just not having particularly much luck that side. I'm getting a great grip here at the moment. But... Oh, there we go, that's a bit of cast. There we go. I'm in again. Two pound rainbow. Oh, might be a bit fresher than the other one. Then on the pheasant tail. Seem to be on natural at the moment. There we go, got him this time. Nice. Well, that's another nice uh, fish, but it's, it's again a bit slabby, a recovering fish. A little rainbow, quite nice, maybe two, two and a half pounds. Uh, yeah, nice fish. So I've just changed to uh, my version of a C3 101 uh, and a flashback pheasant tail stall. Just with the, uh, it's a double beaded version of that C3 101, just so I can get down a bit deeper in this uh, slightly deeper section at the head of this. Make sure I'm getting down. I wasn't sure that that, that uh, caddis was getting down that well anyway. So we'll see if this combination works better and nothing today has taken the uh, caddis yet so we've all taken the flashback pheasantale so there may be something a little bit more natural than the pink beaded fly will, will also get taken and double my chances so they definitely seem to be on the naturals today yeah, could be a good drift I kind of want it a little bit further over but There we go, got him. I thought it was a good drift. <laughs> I kind of stole your fish there. That's a jumping mad, more fresh fish. It's over the other side of the river and off. Gone. Gone. That was a crazy fresh fish. That was a fresh fish. He was just going nuts. He just jumped, he just came off. I don't think, I don't know what happened. Let's see if we can get one further up. Oh, John's got one. Nice. Nice. Okay, the camera and a little bit of filming. Boom. Oh, down below the bridge is also hooked up. Unfortunately, John's uh, fish managed to evade him, same as mine. Let me try and go across a bit more. Oh, right. no, I uh, got about four so far. You just hooked one as well. Yeah, so. It's, uh, it's been going all right here. I had a few this morning as well, so. I had a few this morning. And yourself? And yourself? Yeah, yeah, not just enjoying the day, eh? Oh, it's a fantastic day, isn't it? Beautiful. I'm lucky to be here, that's for sure. Oh, there seems to be a few fish in the river. Most of the ones I've got were were a bit slabby but the last one I just lost was uh, quite quite fresh and there we got another one I wasn't even looking at the indicator 
<laughs> I was, uh, yeah, I was sorry, I was chatting to you and I didn't even look at the indicator. Next thing is gone. Feels a bit stronger than the last ones. Yes, indeed. You too, enjoy your day. Oh, there we go, nice. Yep, that took the uh, heavier fly. Bomb. Nice. Very nice. Oh, he's got a bit of a scar on him. Yeah, he's got a bit of a bit of damage there. Yeah, that's a nice fish. But it's really recovering, but yeah, better have a go out of it. Oh, there was my net. Whoa! That wasn't your fish. You lost it? The fish just jumped here. I thought it was yours. There we go. Oh, that's it. Oh, he busted me. Yep, that was a strong fish, man. It took off a vengeance. It took everything. Whoa. Oh, nice. Try to keep that one on. enjoy that video please check out adrift fishing that's john's channel and uh, see his version of today so yeah i look forward to seeing you in the next one and thanks for watching <laughs>